Hello guys and welcome to RyGB Flying Historical Battles uh, Today we are going to see a couple of short clips of me flying a Jack 1B uh, You are not going to see a lot of kilos in these videos, actually you are going to see none uh, But this is to represent that this plane, this plane actually a Jack 1B is, is a pretty nice plane I, I haven't flown it a lot before but it's quite cool uh, The problem I had when flying this plane was that let's say the teams were under par <laughs> let's say it that way the teams weren't exactly the brightest around you can see me here uh two fagul bananas we have an la5 uh, up here as well the rest of the team is cutting trees down there uh, on the ground they are uh, loud knowing and doing absolutely nothing we have another LA5 which was too busy killing the AIs we have three IL2s which were, of course were going for grand targets I'm not going to criticize them for them but yeah I mean when you only have four fighters you want all of them up there um, well in this case it wasn't that way also the only guy who came up yeah that's what he did absolutely nothing head on in uh, for good for any which is always a good idea isn't it so I'm up here alone with two focal fan enemies. Um, yeah, uh, things are not going to be very easy for me because those are not stupid. Those are not your stupid kind of focal fan enemy who start trying to outturn you. Uh, they boom and zoom. And all I can do is, well, you're going to see it, is to defend myself. And you're going to see how I do it. It's a 2v1, I'm gaining separation, well, I'm gaining separation, I'm trying to win as much time as I can. Break turn, change my plane of movement, he's breaking away, okay. So, that guy is not coming anymore, where was the other one? There he is. And of course, he's also coming. So, break turn again. Change my plane, start a, um, a barrel roll, he overshoots, I try to come back home, but of course we are 2v1, so I don't have a huge lot of, uh, of time to capitalize on that, and anyway he's way too fast for me to catch up. So I break turn in the other uh, in the side, because I know the focus one is coming, uh, scissor, Put some sort on him because he has overshoot and again it's time to move on and see where the other guy is because probably he's coming back and there you go here there he is keeping my speed up i want to have as much speed as i can because i'm trying to move towards my base my plan is to try to land but well you are going to see that's not going to be possible but roll he gets a couple of seals on my wing, but nothing to worry. Keep on the the move. Finish it off with a low yo-yo. And back to see what's coming up. Next is that other focal flying enemy. So I break turn in the opposite direction. I wait for him to be close. Ah, uh, no, he's breaking away. So I have some time to, time to breathe here. The other one is coming already. So I turn towards him to avoid his head on. He's zooming away, he's not coming for me. So it's going to be time to look where is the other guy. Yeah, yeah well, uh, we. I, I'm the only fighter uh, up right now. Um, the B-63 was carving bombs, by the way. That's you. what you get in Soviet teams. Uh, here is the other focus on any. I avoid him. And try to go towards my base. I'm not going to try to hide in, in NTRK France. I'm going to try to get a little bit of... There you go, I'm, I'm the last one. So it's the whole enemy team versus me. Uh, what I'm going to try is to uh, get over my base, slow down enough to try to land. But of course that's going to have some troubles because the whole enemy team will be on me. 
Y como se fue fue muy fue Nene, break turn. Roll opposite. And now well, we have zero incoming so I'm not going to be able to keep this up for a long time. So I'm going to try to reach uh, my airbase at any cost. Look back, the A6 M3 is coming very close. Those guys up here, up there, are killing the AI, so winning me a little bit of time. And now I'm at the airbase, but of course I'm at 500 kilometers per hour. There is no way I'm going to be able to land at this speed. So I have to avoid a further attack, which is coming now. Breaks away, roll opposite, because I know the zero probably is going to come. No, he's actually not coming. He's going for the anti aircraft. Still at 300 km per hour, not going to be able to land. I'm going to try to wait for a window where no one is over the field and try to land there. The zero is giving me. Oh, I missed a shot. But that wasn't a, a bad angle. For a roll, try to get behind him. I get hit and I can't control my plane and I'm going down. But still surviving the bounces of two focal point enemies for that long time and getting uh, a couple of hits of one of them was good enough given that it was the only guy who was trying to fight. Another battle, Henkel 112 coming up for me. I go purely in the vertical because I'm faster and I'm going to... My plan is to um, do a hammer on him. Actually a wing over, more than a hammer. You can see me lining up my wing to start the move, but then I spot BF-109, and he's much faster than me, and the BF-109F, with that an F, is a solid fighter, it's better than the Jack 1B, uh, especially in the vertical, so he has the energy, he has the plane, so he doesn't come for the head on, here I am analyzing his movements, he's not coming back for me like a bloodthirsty guy, He's actually zooming and then coming back. Right now I know I'm versus a good pilot. That guy, I know he's good. Because he has done the proper movements in the opening after the merge. So... I try to stay in the defensive but not forgetting the offensive. I want to keep my nose pointed towards him as much as I can. He's dropping behind me. I could throttle. Deny him the shot. Engaging a scissor, roll opposite, he's over shooting, roll opposite, okay, I have the position for a second, but he's got the energy, he's faster and he's using the vertical, and the Jack 1B can't ke keep it the vertical versus a uh, BF109F. Still, he's giving me a decent shot, but I miss. 500 meters was not really a, a, an easy shot, but... Well, I just took it just in case. So he's flying in a downwards spiral using his super superior acceleration. He's going in the vertical again using the vertical. Beautiful 109 uh, flying. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful flying. Uh, I spot I can't keep up with him in the vertical, so I try to cool his angles and to predict his movements. I could behind him, still I'm much slower than him, I'm not going to be able to to go for him. He's in front of me, but I'm in the defensive here. He's coming back, I set up shot and I miss it. And that was a good chance, but I was too, too, too slow to properly put my plane in the proper attitude to shoot. So again, move for him. This is one of the best one-on-one -on -one fights I have ever had in, in in this game. Beautiful flying from his part. He's won my six with a pretty nice good back. So barrel roll again, forcing him to overshoot. There you go. He has already overshoot. I keep on going, accelerate. Good engine again to ensure my position when I good back behind him. Then go again, full throttle, check the ground, I don't want to crash. 
under his and now I'm in a very offensive position because he's much slower but I totally bought myself here here I, I should have gotten the kill but well my aim you know and now he's a he's no longer a 1v1 which is a pity because I wanted I really wanted this fight to, to go on 1v1 beautiful flying on his side very competent so again now he's totally defensive, he has one AI and the Jack 1T, Jack 9T on him. And I'm not going to get him, it's going to be the Jack 9T who kills him. Again, he's giving me a decent shot, I try to take it, get some hits. But, well, he has one or two shots, so... No kill, of course. Good again, I miss the shot. He's actually keeping his, his speed up pretty well. But, of course, 2v1 and an AI, he's not going to to get a lot of chances to focus on one of us, so... Okay, he's trying to scissor, could engine somewhat, roll opposite, full throttle, and again he's moving the vertical, beautiful, beautiful flying, really. That guy was a really good pilot. Okay, uh, here we go with an inverted loop, I could engine, I don't want to crash when I go up, but the Jack 90 gets him. So that was a very beautiful fly, and one of the best fights I've won one I have had in, in War Thunder so far, uh, in historical battles. Really competent pilot, both of us flying our planes to the extreme and to the best of our capabilities. And yep, yeah, I thought this would be cool to show you guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed, I hope you liked it, um, I hope you had a good time and as always any comment you want to make in the comment section below, uh, like if you like this video, and as always guys thank you very much for watching and see you later.